from the Journal of Aframus Long Journey, Pilgrim, with notes by Avos Tor, scholar of Reeve Library. Rock Day, 16th cycle, 7th year, 81st turn. 21st day in the trees. Suja saved us today. We had been walking along the path when we saw something glinting in the bushes. We started to look more closely when Suja jumped out of my hood, where she had been sleeping. She stared at the bushes and let out a low growling. Torn and I both stopped, wondering what was the matter. Finally, Torn took a rock and tossed it into the bushes. There was a snap and something thrashed around for several seconds. I got a glimpse of large eyes and a very large mouth before the bushes were still again. Note, I have never heard of such a creature. Clearly an ambush predator of some sort. I wonder if the lure is a natural part of the creature's body, or if it was a tool user. It could have been nearly anything. I suppose. Torn had no idea what it was, only that it would be a bad idea to investigate more closely. We stayed more towards the middle of the path the rest of the day. This evening, we both praised Suja mightily, and she basked under the attention, butting her head against us so that we would scratch her lightly behind her ears. I am glad that she is doing so well. She is growing quickly, and will soon be too big to sleep in my hood while I walk. She caught another rat this evening, and I believe soon she will be moving on to larger prey. Note, and again, he didn't describe what could very well have been a very significant rat. I despair. However, Torn is somewhat less happy to see her hunting instincts developing so well. While he was petting her, she rolled onto her back and bit down through the wrapping on his wrist. He yelped and pulled his hand away quickly, suffering scratches where her claws had been hooked into his arm. He was only slightly annoyed, though he knew she did not mean any harm. However, in the future, I suspect that he will be more careful when 